measuring at 1.5 by 1.1. Right? So that's my here. That seems really boring, whatever you are listening to. It is really boring. <sighs> But at least you don't have to, like, they don't have their eye on you. They can't watch you being bored. You know, you That's true. Anonymously. No camera here. Thank goodness. You okay under there, right? Yep. Okay. Well, you got one thing behind oh. there. It's okay. Okay, of course, I'm back. You shouldn't feel anything like I said, other than us touching you. Let's treat. We're gonna try to go just on top of this cyst and remove that little opening too. Make sure we hopefully we get it all this way. You can see the top of it right here. Against you, not pushing you, I'm trying to push you down into the table, but you gotta push this out and it's in your back, so it's a little hard to squeeze all that out. This has been squeezed on before by your husband, so it might be, has a little scar tissue. I kind of already warned her. With these, there's a chance they can recur. I wonder if I should have told you guys in the beginning, but I think, let's see how much I can push up first, and then maybe, when they all come up, maybe it'll show up right here, so. Maybe, maybe not, we'll see. Still under there. Actually, yeah, maybe we can scoop some of that out. Why don't you go ahead and do that? Because then they look uh, looks messy. It looks messier when they're bigger like that, you think? Well, when I you're think your brows look like, yeah. Yeah. Because you have to be patient with them. Yeah. I thought that was part of it, but I think it's just that, that I saw the sack wall, but I think that was just flakes. Oh, maybe. Grab it. Doesn't want to be grabbed. So, my girl just brought me a crispy correct. Let's see if we can't scoop some of that out. These back ones are always deceptive. They always are actually can 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 really take up some space in our back. See, it's still there. Oh, that's the middle one. I feel it. So that's part of the sack. Just make sure you're okay. I just have to kind of scratch at it with a little spoon kind of device to scratch up all the fragments. Let's see some in the corner there. 
your husband's gonna be so sad he's got nothing to squeeze anymore. Well, he hasn't done it for years. Oh, yeah? You forgot about it, or he didn't really like it? I wouldn't let him. Oh, you wouldn't let him. Oh, so he liked it. Kind of enjoyed it. I guess. Sick perversion. Well, no, you should go. That's why we're filming this. A lot of people like to watch it. You should show them to our YouTube channel. Never mind. You might, never mind? Well, you know. It's better than him going to the bar or gambling or anything. Keeps him at home. Not too bad of an addiction, in other words. There we go. Here's some of it. It is stuck to her. Now I am happy we just did one. So since this is kind of scarred down, it's a little harder to make sure we clean it all out. Getting there though. He's, he's um, using the saddle looking better. This one too soon. Okay. Scar, so sometimes scar is harder to snip. See how it went down this direction, huh? Look, you can see where it kind of was had its home, it was just diving down there. Okay, let me clean it all up so that we can put a little stitch there. If I don't trim this, it might not sit as nicely. Trim this little edge here. Just a little baby, like they're not. I don't, know, I don't know what's going on over there. Okay. I'm not doing anything perfect there because I just have one faithful, one deep stitch. And she's coming back in 14 days or something, you said? Two weeks. Two yeah. weeks, okay. Yeah, okay. Very good. All right. 